hi friends welcome to our channel so today uh, let us see preventive maintenance uh, the other day we have seen breakdown maintenance so today we are going to see preventive maintenance what is its importance and what exactly it is so it is also called periodic maintenance or time based maintenance in this what will you do you are going to service the vehicle or maintain the vehicle okay so at regular interval of times that is how it is called periodic maintenance or time based maintenance it can be defined as let us see the definition it can be defined as actions performed on time interval based on or run basis kilometers per kilometers right okay for example you have uh, your vehicle has a run certain uh, kilometers say 1000 kilometers 2000 kilometers right so after that without waiting for any issues or whatever it is right so let the issues come or not we are going to go for uh, servicing of servicing of the vehicle or maintaining of the vehicle or repair of the vehicle whatever it is right so we are going to do some some sort of maintenance right so actions performed on time interval basis or run basis kilometers that discover prevent or mitigate deprivation of system for sustaining its intended life this is how it is defined now it follows a famous glitch prevention is better than cure so definitely for example we are uh, we, we are afflicted with uh, some any disease right so instead of going for that so we are going to take the precautionary measures not to be inflicted by any disease or like that so something like that only so your vehicle maintenance is also preventive maintenance is also something like that so it is something like prevention is better than cure maintenance can be performed on weekly monthly half yearly or yearly basis depending upon vehicle machine parts etc as we all know that human life is some something like he is giving the same example here as we all know that human life is extended by preventive medical care and treatment the same is true for the vehicle as well so, so for example you are going for the preventive maintenance of your vehicle or machine so definitely it is going to increase the life of the machine or vehicle that is how that is the principle on which it is going to depend upon right so let us uh, let us uh, once again uh, uh, say that again once again so as we all know that human life is extended by preventive uh, medical care and treatment the same is true for the vehicle as well so preventive maintenance is a systematic uh, system uh, with all points defined and planned well in advance so we have we will see a figure shortly uh, the fact is that it is ignored that it is ignored by most of the people and industries due to misconception of higher cost associated with it so normally we assume that it is going to cost us more preventive maintenance is cost us more but it is not so okay uh, but in, in reality it is less expensive so how let uh, how it is less expensive let us see one should compare not only the cost but also the long term benefits and savings associated with the definitely we are going to have long term benefits and also we have got some savings also associated with the preventive maintenance so preventive maintenance always improves the vehicle life and its performance it has other advantage let us see the other advantage it has other advantage also like less downtime and replacement cost so we are actually servicing the vehicle or maintaining the vehicle on a time basis or regular basis okay so it is going to definitely uh, uh, result in uh, less downtime and replacement cost flexibility for adjustment of schedule maintenance maintenance based on use and mission if you consider its disadvantages it has got its own disadvantage also so what is the disadvantage is that we can say that failures are not completely limited so by the fact that you are going for the preventive maintenance you cannot assure that your vehicle is not going to fail you cannot say that right so definitely it can fail but definitely failure can be postponed or failure can be prevented okay it's it's something like that if you consider its disadvantages we can say that failures are not completely omitted for defining maintenance schedule and checks technical expertise and experience is required this also has chances of incidental damage to component while doing preventive maintenance some, some sometimes what happens because actually uh, because actually before it is giving it is going for breakdown you are uh, you are maintaining your vehicle or servicing your vehicle on a time based regular basis sometimes some uh, parts may get damaged etc like that okay so damage to cut component while uh, doing preventive maintenance all and all that means overall all and all one can say that preventive maintenance is more advantageous than your reactive maintenance okay so what we have done uh, we have done today so we have talked about the preventive maintenance our next topic is your predictive maintenance we will see the predictive maintenance and we have actually uh, where the timing at the beginning of the lecture we have seen that there are about six types of maintenances right so so far we have seen one uh, first of all uh, first and foremost important uh, breakdown is uh, your maintenance is breakdown maintenance and second 
maintenance we have seen is today we have seen is preventive maintenance. So, tomorrow's class in the next class we are going to see the what is predictive maintenance and like that we are going to complete the different types of maintenance, its advantages, disadvantages and what exactly they are ok. Ok guys, so once again let us meet in a very nice video once again all the best good luck. So, thanks for watching my video and also if you like please subscribe my channel ok that is the favor you can do for me once again all the best good luck. And uh, one, one more request if you are watching my channel for the first time please subscribe like comment and share among your groups and contacts all the best.